Demi Lovato and Taylor Swift are far from friends, and it's safe to say that the two can never get along. In fact, they're anything but friends. But what's way more interesting than their long-going feud is the reason why Demi can't stand Taylor Swift. Is Demi jealous of Taylor? Is Kim Kardashian a reason Demi dislikes Taylor? Is Taylor's squad really dissing Demi? Want more details? Well, let's dive in. All the new artists, the new female artists who are killing it out there right now, we're so inspired by you and... At the 2018 Billboard Music Awards, Taylor was nominated for five Billboard Awards, and she won the award for Top Female Artist. While she was on stage giving her winning speech, our girl Demi is constantly glaring at her as though something of hers was snatched. Jealousy is dripping right from her face. And wait, it's not just us. There were numerous other critics out there who were able to seek the J face of Demi. Why so jealous, Demi? It's not just that. She actually took it to Twitter and wrote, take something to Capitol Hill or actually speak out about something and then I'll be impressed. This was Demi trying to criticize Taylor for her generous $250,000 help for Kesha. Fans criticized Demi for being jealous. One fan wrote, Acting is different than showing support on social media and then closing the app to sleep. Your comment was so unnecessary. Another one echoed, I'm finding it super hard to support Demi sometimes, dude. She literally sits there like a local at a concert, so unimpressed by everything, and jealous of everyone. Like, I don't get it. Just support your fellow musicians? And I'm not even just talking about Taylor. Fans were literally bored of Demi trying to make everything about her when it seriously doesn't concern her. Every other comment on this tweet asked Demi to calm down and stop making everything about her. Yeah, like, that would stop Demi. She responded to these comments and said, how the fuck am I making this about myself? At least I'm talking about it. Not everyone has 250k to just give to people. Would love to, but I didn't grow up with money and deaf haven't made as much as her. At least I speak up about shit that's uncomfortable to talk about, rather than trying to be politically correct 24-7. If you think that jealousy is the only factor influencing the feud between the two, wait till you check out the other burning reasons reason for this whole fight. To find out exactly why Demi isn't fond of Taylor, we need to look into a historical but very popular fact that both of them dated the middle Jonas brother, Joe. Remember, Demi has been a very close friend of Joe, and this whole feud became even bigger when Taylor dated Joe in 2008, and used the alleged 27-second phone call from Joe to gain more popularity and to diss him. True, right? Well, that is at least what Demi believes. Demi took this personally because one, Joe was close to her, and two, again, she has to make everything about herself. Even a breakup that is not really related to her. Don't get us wrong, we aren't taking sides because it's not like Taylor is any less. She leveraged the public split between her and Joe and blabbed about it everywhere, from The Ellen Show to Saturday Night Live. Post this, Demi dated Joe for a brief period of time until Joe broke it off. He publicly mentioned, it was my choice to break up with her. I will continue to be her friend and be there for her. And Demi also refuted all the rumors related to her breakup and tweeted, I'd like to clear a few things up. First, Joe and I split, but it wasn't over the phone. She can Continue. Things didn't work out, but we'll remain friends. Secondly, I am not dating anybody already. Well, you had us at split, dear, but the whole not breaking up over the phone thing, again, bored us to hell. Why is she so obsessed with Taylor? This breakup was about Joe and Demi, but she had to somehow include Taylor in the mess. This was Demi taking a dig at Taylor for her alleged 27 second phone call breakup story. God, you seriously need to calm down. If this was not it, Demi probably dislikes Taylor for spoiling her friendship with Selena Gomez. Selena and Demi have been really close since their Barney and Friends days, but they weren't really close after Selena became besties with Taylor. The sort of relationship Demi had with Selena, she would probably have been heartbroken when Selena, in an interview with Rolling Stone, openly claimed Taylor as her only friend in the industry. Selgo said, I never fit in with a cool group of girls that were celebrities. My only friend in the industry is Taylor Swift. So I remember feeling like I didn't belong. I felt the presence of everyone around me living full lives. I had this position and I was really happy, but was I? Did these materialistic things make me happy? She realized, I just didn't like who I was because I didn't know who I was. Yeah, we aren't speculating this one here's proof of Demi being really jealous and disappointed of the friendship brewing between Selgo and Taylor. Oh my god, she is so jealous of Taylor being friends with her ex-bestie Selgo. Demi has 100 other reasons to hate Taylor, but here's another one that we have really seen her pining over and over. It's about Taylor and her squad. In an interview with Glamour magazine, Demi slammed Taylor for having a squad and for leveraging the squad to tear Katy Perry down, which is quite anti-feminist. She said, To be honest, and this will probably get me in trouble, I don't see anybody in any sort of squad that has a normal body, Lovato said. It's kind of this false image of what people should look like and what they should be like. And it's 
it's not real. It's not realistic. And I think that having a song in a video about tearing Katy Perry down, that's not women's empowerment. We all do things that aren't, but I have to ask myself, am I content with calling myself a feminist? Yes, because I speak out. The reference about body image expectations is connected to the fact that the squad consists of several members from the Victoria's Secret clan. Now here's what Taylor thinks of Demi's comments about her squad. An insider told E! News, Taylor has a tight group of women in her life that all have her and each other's back. And sometimes people just want that, the source said. She thought it was unnecessary for her to make those comments. They both have never really been good friends. She considers her jealous. Well, from the looks of it, it kind of seems that she is jealous, right? There are too many reasons, but the sole reason is the fact that she simply doesn't get along with her. She confessed it herself. In an interview with Refinery29, she said, listen, there's nothing positive that comes from pitting women against each other. There are women that I don't get along with, and that's fine. My thing is, don't brand yourself a feminist if you don't do the work. I have an immense amount of respect for women like Lena Dunham or Beyonce, who make amazing political statements through their work. We all know who she's directing these comments to, and so let's just be clear, she doesn't like her. From criticizing Taylor to accusing her of promoting body negativity, Demi has done it all. Still, neither she nor anyone else knows what's the real reason for her hate towards Taylor. Is it Taylor's success? Is it because people like Taylor? Or is it the fact that Taylor has it all? Money, friends, and success too. Is Kim Kardashian Kardashian also a part of this whole feud? Well, that only Demi and Taylor can tell. But all the latest celeb gossip, we've got it covered. So stay tuned for all the juicy details.